my wings and promise. Ah! Ta-da! It's the Christmas tree! So shiny, so sparkle I just adore Christmas, don't you? Can it be that time of the year already? Ugh. I never get any presents I want. And I spend so much time and care on my gifts. Oh, how nice. They're so... Black. Oh, a scrubbing brush. <laughs> How thoughtful. Perfect for those hard to get at bathroom corners. Yes, mistress, it's the thought that counts. Now, just pop on your gown and come along with me. Take the park with all things jolly. La 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 la. And enough with that infernal Christmas cackle, Fang Face. La 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 la. <sighs> Beauty. Perfect. Hmm. It's a tad overdone, wouldn't you say? Now that we have this wonderful tree, we'll be getting a visit from a dear little Christmas fairy. A Christmas fairy? The Santa sends fairies from the North Pole to every Christmas tree in the world. The fairy cares for the tree right through the holidays. <laughs> <Whee>! <laughs> I'm Jingle. Santa sends his warmest greetings to everyone who's been especially nice. Pearly and Opal, Jasper, and, um... Aren't you forgetting someone? Oh, that's right. Ludwig. <gasps> Me? I'm in Santa's good books? And did he mention Sapphira? No, but maybe I've forgotten or something. So, Jingle, if there's anything I can do to help, you just ask. Hey, thanks, Pearly. This is my first tree ever, and I'm going to take really good care of it. I'll make sure it stays green and beautiful with my bag of Christmas fairy dust. A sprinkle of this now and then will keep the branches in jolly good order. Hmm. Ludwig, home now! Yes, ma'am. Now, Jingle, let me help you with that bag. Ugh! You heard that pesky jingle. If I'm not on Santa's list, there'll be no presents for me. <laughs> what have I done to deserve this, Ludwig? Haven't I been kind and loving all year? Uh, uh, what a good question. Uh... <laughs> Ow! Oh, wow! Ah! Oh, you buffoon, get going. Ah! Well, haven't I brought peace on Earth and goodwill to all? Haven't I? Uh, uh, Oh, yes, mistress. Uh, as you say, you know, good and kind and... Uh, yes, yes. Exactly. So if I'm not getting any Christmas presents, 
I'll make sure Pearly doesn't either. I wonder what Santa would think of Precious Pearly if he saw the tree was a mess. <gasps> oh, mistress! No! Not the Christmas tree! Please! Her face would be redder than Rudolph the Reindeer's nose. <laughs> Hello, little Jingle. You're doing such a good job minding the tree. Thanks, Sapphira. But aren't you just an itsy bit tired? It's after midnight. No, I'm fine, really. I'll have a nap when the sun comes up. But that's hours away. Are you sure you don't want to take a teensy nap now? Well, if you promise to take care of the tree, I guess a tiny sleep wouldn't hurt. I promise. I promise. I promise to do no such thing. <laughs> it's Christmas Eve. <laughs> the tray, mate. It's a disaster, dude. It's totally trash. Oh no. Jingle? Oh, Pearly. I don't know what happened. One minute I was wide awake, and the next thing I know, it's morning and my, my tree. Santa will be so mad at me. No, no, I'm sure he won't be. Pearly, this tree is a disgrace. The worst of any park in the entire city. You simply cannot let small persons see this, this stuff thing. Oh. Oh. Gobsmack, please. <laughs> It's Jingle's first ever tree. Don't worry, one sprinkle of Christmas dust will put things right again. That's just it. I can't find my bag of dust anywhere. I see. Well, I'll have to report this to security at the North Pole pronto. Have a heart, dear Gobsmack. It's Christmas. How about we help Jingle with the decorations while you go look for her bag of dust? Please? Ah, <sighs> all right then. I'll go back to Fairy HQ and see if anyone's handed it in. <laughs> Okay, Jingle, let's get to work. Oh, oh, Blanky, we cannot let this happen. Christmas is our favorite time of the year. We have to fix this. Here goes. Wow, how will we ever get them up there? They're so heavy. Well, Jingle, the spirit of Christmas is alive in Jubilee Park. <laughs> Hello, everyone. So, I want this right up there on the top of the Christmas tree where Jingle can find it. Wow, that's a long way up, and this bag is heavy. That's gonna cost you two cheese balls, pal. Okay, okay, it's a deal. Just hurry, hurry, before Mistress sees us. No problemo, Jumpster. Hey ho! Off we go! What? Yeah. Look at that! <laughs> my bag of dust to make the tree green again. Did you find it, Gobsmack? Sadly, no. I suspect it may have been stolen. Stolen? <gasps> but don't you worry, Jingle. I'll find that bag. But wait! Hi. Look! It, it's up there! <clears throat> what? How did that... Where's Ludwig? Here, mistress! Oh! My, my, my! 
Why? What are those two vermin telling? <laughs> Why, it's Jingle's bag of magic dust, of course. Obviously, they're the ones who stole it. How do you know it was missing, Sapphira? We haven't seen you all day. What do you know about this, Sapphira? <laughs> Nothing. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> oh. Hey, you mangy mutt. What? Check. Oh, no. Burly! It's like snow! Simply divine. <laughs> that tree is gorgeously green. What a team effort! Jubilee Park rocks! It sure does. So, Jingle, time for you to take your place at the top of the tree. Small persons are coming. Come on. <laughs> Gee, Pearly, I'm so nervous. Don't be nervous. This is all part of your job, Jingle. You just keep still up there, and none of the persons will know you're a real fairy. Thanks for everything, Pearly. And hey, Merry Christmas. And Merry Christmas, everyone. Open it. Open it. A new pearl bracelet. <laughs> Thank you, Santa. Look, mistress. Santa left a gift for you. I know what it will be. A lump of coal. You open it, Ludwig. The mistress. Oh. Oh! First time she's ever been lost for words. Nice, isn't it? I told Santa that even if she is naughty, she still should get a present. Oh, Jingle. You are the kindest Christmas fairy ever. <laughs> Hollyberry muffin, anyone? Awesome. <laughs> la la la, do do do. Rose petal muffins, anyone? She is my awesome. attention. Ah! Go smack! As you know, the Fairy Queen's annual royal gala is almost upon us. This year, Her Majesty is inviting talent from all over Fairyland to audition for the show. You mean any one of us could perform for the Fairy Queen? That's right. I will be conducting the auditions personally, along with a special surprise celebrity judge. <gasps> Who's it gonna be? Well, you'll just have to wait and find out. Auditions are tomorrow. That is all. Buds and blossoms. I wish I could perform for the Fairy Queen. Then you'll get your wish, Pearly. I reckon you're sure to be picked. Your singing voice is as sweet as honey. Let's all audition. I'll bet we can all be in the Fairy Queen's gala. Count me in. Me too, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's practicing for the auditions. It's so exciting. What a dreary bunch. Ta da! Hello, Great Aunt Garnet. Are you auditioning too? You betcha. I'm dusting off my old magic act. Voila! Ah! Maybe you could try pulling out coins or flowers instead. Ah! Good idea. Toodles! Yo to my favorite, Jubilee Fairies. Would you like some tea or a big bowl of cherries? Um, Jasper, what are you doing? I want to make the scene in the concert for the Queen. I want to be a rapper and, uh... Man, this rhyming thing is hard. You just have to keep at it, Jasper. The secret to a pitch-perfect performance is practice, practice, practice! I'm going home to rehearse my song. I'll see you all later. La 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 la. If there's anything more annoying than Pearlie's chirpy little voice, it's got to be her chirpy little work ethic. Practice, practice, practice. <laughs> it's all so ridiculous. Come, Ludwig. Let's leave these foolish showbiz wannabes. Now, what shall I perform for the audition? But but I thought it was also ridiculous. Ridiculous for those talentless fools, but for moi? My only problem is which of my many superlative talents to showcase for the judges. To the spa! 
Yes, mistress. La, la, la. Nice. Now you're talking. All right, all right. Quit showing off. I can do that. Whoa. Whoa. <sighs> there must be something I can do for that wretched audition. <laughs> what are you wearing? This is my costume for the audition. I won the junior bat medallion at the district yodeling festival seven times in my youth. <laughs> Yodale. <laughs> Everyone's got an act except me. And Chirpy Pearly will get to show off in front of the Queen and all of Fairyland via Crystal Ball. Hmm. But what if something dreadful were to happen to Pearly's precious little voice? Yodale! <laughs> <laughs> She's going to bed? What about practice, practice, practice? I really think Pearly should pull an all-nighter. Don't you? <laughs> oh, yes, Miss I feel all funny. Why am I singing? How strange. I can't stop singing. There. That should last till morning. Home, Ludwig. Hurley burly! Oh my goodness! Why can't I stop singing? La 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 All night! I can't believe I sang all night! All night! It stopped. Oh, thank goodness. Dude, did you hear Pearly? She was singing all night long. Yeah, it was like having a kookaburra in my ear. Thank goodness she's giving it a rest. Good morning! <laughs> Our celebrity judge is here. You who? Isn't this exciting? What a dump. Must be Jubilee Park. Not Twinkle Twinkle. Miss Twinkle. I welcome you yada, to... Yada, yada, let's get on with it. Um, ahem. <clears throat> Toodles! Twinkle, Twinkle! She hates Jubilee Park! She didn't exactly have her best concert here. Now, <laughs> 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 uh, Pearly will show that phony diva a thing or two about singing. Pearly, are you ready to blow everyone off the stage, mate? Are you ready to sing? I suppose so. <gasps> Pearly, Pearly! We're actually almost ready to begin, Miss Twinkle. Quite, uh, quite a lot of talent here, as you can see. I want a glass of dew. Make sure it's lukewarm. Yes, of course. No, right away. I'm on it. What would make you sing all night like that? I don't know for sure. Uh, some kind of enchantment, but I have no idea where it came from. Hmm. <laughs> I think I might be able to guess. Well, it's no use auditioning anyway, not with Twinkle as the judge. She'll never pick anyone from Jubilee Park. Oh, I'm sure she'll be fair. She won't hold a grudge. Who's our first loser? Um... Next! Huh? <laughs> Next! Next! Whoa! Get ready to groove, yo! My name is Jasper. We're gonna rock the house and... Next! Yodale. <laughs> Next! <clears throat> Magic in the city. I can't hear you. Louder! Magic in the city. Louder! Magic in the... Next. <laughs> no, no, no! Dreadful! Simply dreadful! But that's everybody. You haven't seen anyone you like in all of Fairyland? We've got zero acts for the Royal Gala. What are we going to do? There's only one solution. I can do the entire show myself. I just still think the Queen would have, you know, liked to see some of these acts. <laughs>
Cheer up, everyone. At least we can watch the gala on the crystal ball. <laughs> Twinkle Twinkle is a horrid little fraud. Can't you get better reception than that? I want to see what the court fairies are wearing. I just want to see the fairy queen. Hmm, I did so want to meet her. The fairy queen is no big deal. She's just a fairy like anyone else. Great Aunt Garnet, we were wondering where you went. Hi-ho. I accidentally zapped us to Tahiti. How's the voice, Pearly? Fine, thanks. La, la, la. <laughs> this reception is bogus. Why don't you sing for us, Pearly? Yeah. Oh, great. Totally. Okay. Magic in the city. Over the rainbow at the end of the street is Jubilee Park where the fairies meet. Away from the traffic in the neon Lovely. Just lovely. Stars and moonbeams. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. That twinkle singer is just not my cup of tea. Would you mind terribly singing a little more for me? It would be a great honor. In fact, we could all put on a little show for you, if, if you'd like. I would love it. Yahoo! Your Majesty. La la la, do do do. Magic in the city. Over the rainbow in fairyland is Jubilee Park, and tonight it's grand with all my best friends making the scene, having the best time, rapping for the queen. Best friends in all of Fairyland. Woo! Oh. 